Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some bursting bubble tea. These are made with fruit juice, so that's what makes them different. This is the passion fruit and apple. This one is mixed berries and hibiscus. And I have mango and red dragon fruit. These were $2.99 each at uh, World Market. And these are the only three flavors World Market had. So they might have more flavors. This is just all we were able to get. So passion fruit and apple made with fruit juice, 16.6 .6 ounces. It does say on the can, serve chilled, shake well before drinking. So at World Market, um, they don't have refrigerators. And so you bring them home and you put them in your refrigerator. That's exactly, I don't see any yet. Finally one came out. A few. A few, yeah. There they are. So we did shake these, but um, they it, it just looks like fruit juice. Uh, there's there's some still in there. Okay. Uh, 176 calories. They don't look like you get a lot. I tell you what, that fills the glass up just barely. <laughs> It's a way to do it. <laughs> I didn't get any up through that thing. Oh, really? I don't like it how they don't want to all come out of the can. It's like, ah, got it all. I got them all. I was going to say, it's like you can't get them all. I didn't get any of the little things. Did you? Yeah, they're not bubble tea. Oh. They're like little shells filled with something. Mm -hmm. So when they say they pop, that's what they mean. They're just... They... Um, it tastes like grapefruit. That is actually... Um, the That coating is actually... It's like a little skin or whatever. The skin. Yeah, well, that's a good word That's what it, it seems like. A little the skin. skin has totally fallen over my back too. <laughs> so it's just sitting there latched on. Uh -huh. So when this review's over, I'm going to have to dig that out. Like an octopus sucker. <laughs> mm, I got it. Okay. Yeah, I don't like that. Um, I'd much rather have bubble tea. I, the, the little uh, tapioca pop things. I'd much rather have those than these. I would too. I, um, I don't, Kevin and I really don't like passion fruit. And there's not enough of the apple there to no, I, make this any better. You would never know it had apple in it. No, so it ta it tastes like you're drinking passion fruit. Um, and and unless you have a big straw like this, you're not going to get those little bubbles or whatever they are. You're not going to get those until the very bottom of the glass, and you're going to no. have a whole just all of those left, and you're drinking them. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. It's not as grapefruity as it could be. But passion fruit, passion fruit is just not our thing. So I'm hoping we'll like some of the other ones. Um, this one is mixed berries and hibiscus, which to me that's Flowery. just as scary because of, we don't like flowers. We're picky people. We don't like flowers in our. Uh, leave it. I would leave it up. No way they'll come out better, baby. No, um, no floral, please. I do see them coming out of there. Oh, yeah. Like quite a few of them. Okay. There's still one in there. Uh, 168 calories. For yeah, they all go. They go to the bottom. Kind of like an old school waffle lamp. <laughs> you know? Uh huh. Oh. I actually like that. I don't mind that at all. No. It, that almost tastes like apple juice, but. That doesn't <laughs> taste. Yeah, that does not have. I hate, though, that you can't get all these things out at one time. Oh, they're gone. Okay, it is gone. Um, I do love that flavor. That's, that's a really nice. I got like three of those little. I got one. You know what? I do like that. I um, flavor that. It reminds me of apple juice, or a, a, I guess it's a mixed berry juice. You know, but skin did the same thing. Yeah, I don't like the I don't like the things they put in there. Mm mm. Because it, it's literally now that one stuck to the roof of my mouth, but way over on the side, it's an annoyance. It's like getting a popcorn hole stuck in your teeth, mm -hmm. and you're just gonna tr try everything you can with your tongue to get it out yeah. until it's gone because it worries you to death. I really do like the flavor. I like the flavor though. I wouldn't have known 
there was anything uh, hibiscus about it. Mm -mm. No, um, no floral. Or... Mm -mm. It does have a really nice mm -hmm. flavor. I don't know that I would say mixed berry. I guess I would. Yeah, it's kind of berry-like. Yeah. Like I said, it can still reminds me, it kind of reminds me of apple juice. But... Mm -hmm. I got that filing. <laughs> I, I don't like those, those things. Uh, this is mango and red dragon fruit, and it is 176 calories. To be addressed. Okay, you told me to leave that up. Yeah, I'm just thinking nothing's blocking it if you do okay. that. The trick with these cans is to turn them upside down like this. You have to turn it upside down. I tell you, and there's still more in there. You have to turn it upside down thing. because if you pour it just regular like you normally would a can, they all stay down in the bottom. No, no it probably has about the same amount. That first can had hardly any in it. Do you see that? Yeah, I know. This one has hardly, I mean, you barely get any of the bottom. Yeah. And this one had it all through there. And this one is, is in the middle. Uh -huh. You know, it's kind of this much. And then you can see this little skin. Yeah, there. and this has a lot. This is up full. to here. Yeah. And you would think they would do it by weight or something. Try that. I don't mind that at all. It just tastes like peach to me. And maybe it's the dragon fruit that... Yeah. yeah, you can eat those things. I, I just want to see if they change the flavor. It, dr it drives me crazy when they get stuck in my teeth like that. I don't want to do that again. And I'm just not crazy about them. This, these are just so different than the, just the regular bubble tea that um, I like the flavor of the it juice. It change the flavor anymore. Without the, the bubbles. I would yeah. rather have just the juice. Um... I'll, I'll actually like the mango very, very much. I, th I do think it tastes like peach, and like I said, maybe it's that red dragon fruit. Um, it tastes better than I thought it would. It I doesn't would, taste funky. No, I'd rather have this one, the mixed berries and hibiscus, but... The mixed berries and hibiscus the best one. is the best one, because it's sweet, yeah. really, really sweet. But then the second one is this mango. Yeah, it's okay. And I wouldn't necessarily get this one. Oh, I would never the get passion the passion fruit. fruit again. And I just belched. Guess the, what came back? Passion fruit. That's what happens. The nasty, whatever the nasty thing was, is what you're going to taste later. Um, so, I, 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 but if you like passion fruit, yeah. you will like that. You like that grapefruit kind of flavor. It does taste like passion fruit. We just don't like passion fruit. Um, These are okay, but I'd much rather have bubble the teas. Bubble tea. The red, well, have, it says bursting bubble tea. It says bursting bubble tea. Yes. I want regular bubble Regular, tea With right. the little uh, tapioca balls. Right. Those are much better. Yes, I agree. I like those more too. Um, these are all for the bubble tea and these popping bubble tea. It's all for people that like texture. Yes. And, and they enjoy that kind of experience. I enjoy textures too. I just don't want it in my drinks. Okay. So I want it in my food. I don't want it in my drinks. And I'm all for having it in the bubble, the regular bubble tea, those tapioca pearls. I really enjoy that. Yeah, you do enjoy those. But I don't like this. No. This isn't the same. When you're sucking this up through the straw, you know when you get the bubble tea and it goes that glomp, 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 <laughs> it goes yeah. through the straw and you're and then you get that whole sensation. You don't get that with no. these. They don't even want to come up through the straw the same way no. at all that the other ones do. So it's it's a different experience with the having it in the juice. Yes. So if you give them a try, you'll have to let us know which one's your favorite or if there's more flavors. This is one that even if I found out there were more flavors, I wouldn't go back to get them because I'm just, I, I don't like how that skin just gets stuck everywhere. Um, so even if there are more flavors, I won't be buying them, but you might be able to help other people out if you list them below, if you know that there are some. So I will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.